So you're moving to Augusta, Georgia, but you have no idea where to live. So the one thing about moving to a new area is often you're not familiar with the area. It can be overwhelming. Let me tell you, it can be scary trying to find the perfect place to live in the perfect area specifically for you and your family. So I'm gonna bring up the actual map to show you the different areas and by the end of this video, you're gonna have a good visual representation and a better idea of the layout of the land here in the Augusta, Georgia area. You'll see how far things are from each other and while going through the map, I'll let you know what you can get in the different areas. I'll show you the value of your dollar when it comes to housing here in the Augusta, Georgia area. Then you'll know a great place to start or that we can help you narrow in on. And that's coming up right after this. Hi, I'm Delarisa Rollerson, Augusta Certified Relocation Specialist, and welcome to the channel. On this channel, you'll learn what it's like to eat, sleep, work, play, and invest in the Augusta, Georgia area. We get calls every day helping people move to the Augusta, Georgia area, and honestly, we absolutely love it. So be sure to subscribe to the channel, press the bell so you'll be notified each time we upload video. And no matter whether you're planning to move here in the next 30 days or the next few months, or even if it's next year, give us a call send us a text or either better yet go ahead and let's schedule an in-person meeting and let's do a zoom the um, link to is in the comments below to schedule a zoom and we've got you covered when moving here to the Augusta Georgia area so today I'm gonna go through the map and I'm gonna really showcase the area so you can see the distance and the location of things in relation to the downtown area the downtown Augusta area the city and also the suburbs so here we'll take a look at our map of the area. We've got a map showing all of our counties. We have six different counties here in the Augusta, Georgia area. We have McDuffie, Columbia County, Richmond, and Burke County. All of those are here on the Georgia side. And then on the South Carolina side, we've got Edgefield and also Aiken. My team and I, we can assist you in any of these areas. Um, the two areas that we're gonna focus on today are Columbia and Richmond counties. So we'll take a deeper dive into those two. So here we've got, uh, we come out a little bit. So here you'll see we've got um, Augusta. So here in Augusta, all of this that you see in white is Richmond County. And everything that you see here over in this area, this area here is Columbia County. So in the counties of Columbia, we have Martinez, we also have Evans, we've got Grovetown, Harlem, and also a portion of Appling. So these are the counties that are in Columbia County. And Columbia County is actually the county where a lot of families have um, drawn to because of the school districts in Columbia County. And then also, this is Richmond County, which is where Augusta is. And Fort Gordon is here. Fort Gordon is actually part, it's in Grovetown. But um, this area here is Augusta and also Hetzaba. Hetzaba is part of Richmond County and so is Goshen. So these areas are all part of, so this here again, this shows you Richmond County. And then these areas here in the outskirt, these are the suburbs. This is showing you Columbia County. So this area is the Augusta metro area. And then here you'll see that Augusta is on this one side. This is the Georgia side. This is the South Carolina side. So George, Augusta, Georgia is literally separated from South Carolina by the Savannah River. The Savannah River separates Augusta and Georgia. North Augusta, so you'll see here, North Augusta is on the South Carolina side. So we do also service the North Augusta homes and you have beautiful homes spread all throughout all of these areas. We have beautiful homes. Because we have Fort Gordon that's here, we've got Cyber Command, and now we've got Amazon. Amazon is over in this area, which is the Appling Harlem area. Those are really bringing a lot of people, and Plant Vogel is here. Those are bringing a lot of people here to our area. So for our housing costs here in the Augusta, Georgia area, in Augusta, the last 30 days, our average sales price for homes was two hundred and forty three thousand nine hundred and forty five dollars 
And then here in Evans, Georgia, over the last 30 days, our home sales price was 454000 In Martinez, our average home sales price was 361000 In Grovetown, our average sales price over the last 30 days was 337 And then when you look at North Augusta, in North Augusta, South Carolina, our average sales price was $316,000. So you've got um, new construction also that is literally spread all throughout. Now, when it comes to master plan communities, um, that really is Grovetown. You'll find master plan communities in Grovetown and also in Evans. Uh, you will have, there are a few in Hetzibah and of course there are some in uh, Augusta, but really Grovetown and Evans has the master plan communities, which are the communities with the um, in-ground pools, also the clubhouses, the trails, got the walking trails. Like Highland Lakes is one of our higher end communities. That is actually in Evans, Georgia. And that has just all of the luxury amenities that people generally are looking for in the Evans, Georgia area, such as lakes for fishing, also swimming pool, clubhouses, also just basically a, a leisurely lifestyle is available here in the Evans, Georgia with the Highland Lakes. I do have one of those videos. So we're gonna go, I wanna take you all deeper into, I wanna look downtown. We'll work our way from downtown, the core, we'll work our way out. We'll branch out from there. So the downtown area, we've got several different districts. As you can see here, we've got the convention district, we have the arts and culture district, we have the entertaining district, the dining district, and of course, as you all probably are very familiar with, is the medical district. So here in Augusta, Georgia, we have 11 different hospitals. Of those 11 hospitals, we have five major hospitals. And here, in those are housed here in the medical district. So when it comes to the downtown area, there is a lot of different improvement that's going on here in the downtown area. So here we do have Old Town, and we also have Harrisburg, we also have Laney Walker, Bethlehem, Somerville, the Sand Hills, the, and this is all down to Old Town is here. So these are all areas that are really going through a lot of regentrification. Old Town is an area where you have a lot of historic Victorian homes, literally from the early 1900s. These are homes that have high ceilings, elegant wood panels, crown molding, and also in Laney Walker. Laney Walker, Bethlehem area, these are two areas that are really going through, these are historic neighborhoods as well, going through revitalization process. So we've got building, here you'll have a lot, a mixture of a lot of older homes and also newer homes. So you have new homes and homes that are being renovated and uh, commercial and retail development is going on here as well in this area. So you've got a lot of ranch style and also two story homes that are here in the Laney Walker, Bethlehem area. We've got apartments and lofts. We also do have a few gated access apartments that are literally near the uh, river here, near the river and it's right along here along the canal here in um, downtown Augusta. Somerville. Somerville is an area, it's also known as the Hill. Very affluent area, historic district. You Here you have mature trees, you've got the large, beautiful historic homes. So this is really what you would, some people would call is like the old money northwest <laughs> of downtown district. It's literally eight minutes from downtown. These are homes that range between 140000 up to $900,000. You've got beautiful, beautiful homes here in the Somerville, Somerville area. So you got the Somerville and Sand Hills areas right, right here together. So going back to, we take a look at downtown Augusta. So when we look at downtown Augusta, there are a lot of housing options in the vicinity of downtown. We have apartments, we have that's for rent, of course, we have lofts, we have condos that you can purchase. We also do have single family homes. So when you take a look, our main street running in the heart of downtown is Broad Street. So this is Broad Street here. Broad Street, if you get on Broad Street, you can literally go 
on Broad Street all the way through entire downtown. So you can go from the dining district to the convention district on Broad Street, the arts and culture, the entertainment district. It's basically is all alone here. And then it takes you all the way through to Old Town, which is the older historical part of Augusta. So here downtown, you've got the apartments, you have the condos, you do have, we do have a lot of lofts that are here along Broad Street. Then here you'll see in the arts and culture district, you've got um, the boyhood home of President Woodrow Wilson is here uh downtown in the arts and culture district we've got the bell auditorium the james brown arena is here we also have a lot of different the, the imperial theater is here the miller theater is right along broad street so on broad street literally right across the street from one another you have the imperial theater on one side the miller theater on the other side and some of you all may have seen the james brown statue is here which is right near the augusta commons and so as we walk along here, so here, this walking path, if you walk along Broad Street, the dining district, you have a variety of restaurants to choose from here in the downtown Augusta area. So now that we've taken a closer look at the map and getting closer to what you really need is really what's really going to be important next for you and your family and relocating here to the Augusta, Georgia area. I personally relocated from Illinois to Augusta, so I honestly know exactly what you're going through right now. I know it's very important to find housing that's suitable for your particular lifestyle. Also schools, if you're looking for a particular type of school in a certain area, whether you want the city versus the suburbs, also your employment you may want your home to be in a certain distance from your job so definitely give us a call send us a text so we can go ahead and schedule our in-person zoom and we can hone on on the, your specifics in regards to your lifestyle and also in specifics in regards to what you're looking for in a house we'll be happy to assist you and navigate you through the uh, real estate process moving here to the augusta georgia area again i'm delrisa rollerson thanks so much for coming to the channel and see you in the next video